There seems also to be a disconnect between performing arts education in schools and the work of awarding organisations, such as those accredited by the Council for Dance, Drama and Musical Theatre, offering graded examinations in the performing arts through their own networks of specialist teachers. Over 1.1 million such examinations were taken in the UK in 2019, as against 110,000 entries for GCSEs in dance, drama and music, and 17,500 for A-levels. Might he look at how these two approaches could better reinforce each other and increase the maintained sector's access to teaching resources, perhaps indeed by expanding the role of music education hubs to cover this? How will he ensure that careers advice and guidance fully reflect the opportunities available in the creative sector? And when will the government finally get to grips with the damage done by the EBAC to music and arts teaching in schools? Uh, 